I hope you're having an amazing day. My name is Colin and in this video we're going to have a look at one of the maybe few bear market opportunities. The Effin land sale is coming up for the Nexus world. One of the few projects I'm actually super bullish about. So I am a early investor in the Effin project. The token has done really well even through the navigation of the bear market. And now the Nexus World land sale is coming up. Phase one opening in four days, uh, 21 hours. So that uh, should be, if I recall correctly, the 8th of October. I have part one uh, over here, which explains uh, how the land sale is going to work. Uh, quite brief. Uh, I did have a conversation with Lucas Lee, the CEO of FN, to get a complete picture about how this works. So if I actually explain something, I explain it properly, right? Uh, the entire Nexus world is huge, uh, 33.9 billion hexagons, 82%-ish common, 15% rare, 3% epic, 0.3% mythical. However, non-water uh, uh, land is uh, about 29%. So it basically matches the entire real world demographic. Uh, the most important thing for the land that is for sale for holders, there is a maximum supply of 100,000 units, as we see uh, quite a lot these days with the actual virtual land sales right hexagon land description what it looks like and how many there are total so for the mythical one the most elite there are only 300 the sum up basically right here as i just described the part two is the most interesting one so here we basically go into detail about what's actually being offered so they did obviously the buddies which was uh which went really well that meant that i think the, the mint was like $150. The floor price last time I checked was like $1,000. So uh, that did really, really well. The supply was really small, right? 300 buddies per kind. Uh, the supply here is a lot bigger. We are more uh, further advanced in the bear market, but these lands are extremely affordable. Uh, you can earn rewards from players that visit your land to complete tasks, right? With the land, so the monetization options. Uh, buddies can spawn from your land, which basically are the NFTs that accompany players in the Nexus world. Um, in addition to that, uh, you can amplify your land with various models. Uh, mayor, owner of the land, citizens, uh, taxes, uh, population size. There are a lot of gamification metrics that you should be aware about and you can read them all right here. So what I'm most interested in is the format, right? So the format is that 50% of the land NFTs will be made available uh, pre-game launch. So that is of the Nexus world. What that means is that uh, there will be different sales stages, right? But also for the actual players that are going to play the game, not solely investors, there will be 50% of the land available to them. I think this is a really mature choice of the FN project to not basically flood the land uh, and make a cash grab to investors which might not achieve the true utility of the land because of these gamification models right if investors just hold the land do not participate in the real world economy uh, of the nexus world then you would have a slight decline in the gamification element so if you offer 50 percent to potential investors uh, with a small percentage of gamers i assume there as well and then 50 percent to the gamers it makes a lot more sense uh, as the Nexus world is newly discovered, we will lead you on a pioneering expedition to explore city by city and claim your land by planting flags. The first step towards getting your land in the Nexus world is to purchase flags starting October 8th. So to be able to buy your flag, you need to register on the FN marketplace. I'm signed in. You need to complete KYC uh, to be able to purchase flags. So if you click on purchase flags, I am KYC'd already. These flags are not NFTs, so there's a very big disclaimer. However, the land is an NFT. So for now, uh, the flags, I think the maximum you can buy is 55 and how much they cost I have right here. So to be able to uh, get your hands on a land, a common land is one flag, a rare land is three flags, a epic land is nine flags and a mythical land is 27 flags. 
The sale phases are as follows. In the first sale, which starts October 8th, which is a couple of days from now, there are 48,482 flags available for a total uh, price per flag of 1,995 fin. If we go to CoinMarketCap right now, assume the price of FN will rise a little bit uh, in the coming days, as I probably it has already, right? Went from five cents to, to eight cents. Um, but we need to, to, to use the calculator for a second, right? Because we want to know. So we have eight cents times times 1995 Ooh. oh fuck there we go 160 bucks on an eight cent price so 160 bucks for uh, one land let's say i want a mythical one because of course i do right at the current price it would be about 4000 which is fine for me to buy i think i can only buy one. Oh no you can buy 55 flags so then you could buy two mythical ones uh, about nine thousand dollars let's say so max uh, per packs so per person 55 flags the second sale is going to take place on december 22nd no 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 December 2022. Sorry, I got fucked up about this date. So the date is still to be announced. There is only 11,828 flags, so a lot less. And at that point, they will cost uh, 3,000 fin token ish. Again, max by 55. In December as well, the cities will launch waves of cities. So every week, I assume a city will unlock. And then um, you can go in and plant your flag. Once you have planted your flag on a certain plot, that now belongs to you. Okay, so here we go. Here we have the date, 1, 1 p.m. UTC. That's a good time for everybody. First come, first serve. Whitelisted users will get a 24 hour head start of the public sale and date time. So FN granted our Digits Club community um, the whitelist spots for this i just hosted a live event as you can see here we just finished the pub quiz that was about half an hour ago we got three winners that got whitelisted uh, if you want to get whitelisted for projects maybe for future effing projects or anything else uh, you can now get whitelisted for the digits agents nft mint join the discord through the link in the description digits agents introduce yourself and participate in our pop quizzes every week you have something cool to win same process in december the city launch from december 2022 onwards we will be unveiling city by city in waves you will be able to take your flags plant them and claim your land a location is one of the factors that could determine the value of a land we want to empower you to decide where a prime location is so this is what it looks like it's a real world map and then you can basically put the flags and they are marked epic mythical common lands and there's some water as well uh, and then there's owner rarity availability uh, biome and then the longitude okay interesting you can pick your land upon claiming your land will be minted to become nfts recognizable with artwork visible on OpenSea. they will also have their own unique correspondent geolocation in the real world and be identified by cell id latitude and longitude each nft can be eventually utilized in the nexus world in summary here are the three steps flag sale but there are some restricted territories uh, for people that cannot participate and unfortunately so do read uh, the compliance carefully because i think that is important to ensure everything goes well so one of the major events i am kyc i have obviously a whitelist spot myself uh, acquired to be able to participate as i'm already kyc i have to wait four hours uh, four days 21 hours 47 minutes 15 seconds in order to buy my flanks uh, and this is i'm not going to say uh, not financial advice to your own research but this is a tremendous opportunity but if you go and join our discord inside the digits club you can definitely see this is one of the few opportunities that a lot of people are talking about uh, fn has done extremely well of course there has to be a small uh, decline right this was like uh, 
devaluation of the token, but it has been extremely stable, where most currencies have gone down 80, 90% over the last couple of months. Uh, FN has stayed strong between five and eight cents. Right now it's a little high because of the land sale, right? But let's say if it keeps stable at six cents, uh, I still hold a lot of FN token myself. Um, and obviously, otherwise I wouldn't make this video if I wouldn't be bullish on it. Uh, one of the main things which uh, I, I have to admit uh, which was the reason why I initially liked FN was because of the team behind the project, right? Uh, even when I asked Lucas, uh, I was talking with a marketing person from FN and then Lucas, the CEO, jumped in. He said, not a problem. We can jump on a call. I can explain it because obviously as critical as I always am, I had a ton of questions. I'm not going to... Uh, I wanted to make the video on the land sale because of the Digits Club community members, right? But I'm not going to make a video if I have questions and it's unclear. I want to give you the right information. They also have a gameplay trailer. Uh, they sent it to me. I just haven't seen it yet. I'm going to watch this later because I really, really like the first trailer. Definitely. So one of, one of the most important things is Lucas, the CEO, he, he jumped on the call with me, explained how the land sale worked. It only took like 15 minutes, allowed me to ask my questions, more complexities, you know, what's the rarity, how does it work, uh, what are the mint waves, uh, everything around it, you know, really, really into to the big details. Uh, everything uh, was explained to me. Uh, very nice looking trailer, almost, uh, well, perfectly in line, I would say, with the first one. Let me not uh, make you over bullish. I just want you to check out the FN NFT sale if that is something that you would be interested in. If you're curious about what I'm doing in the bear market. As usual, I'm not doing that much, right? We're building the Digis Agents. We're very busy building our products, launching on November 3rd. But this is an interesting opportunity that came by that I just quickly want to show you. FN Nexus World Land Sale. To obtain the flags, the first step happening October 8th. More information on the medium of FN, check it out. If you have any questions, as always, leave them down in the description below. I'll be sure to have a look. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.